You want to know how you can do the new trendy latte makeup? In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can do this beautiful one. For the people who don't know me, my name is Leonor, I'm a makeup artist and a makeup lover and here in my channel you can always find videos about makeup. And today I'm really excited to share with you how you can do this new trend makeup, the latte makeup. So let's start it. The latte makeup, it's a makeup that it's very glowy, very bronzed, so our skin should look like that. The first product that I'm going to apply is going to be my foundation. It's not a foundation, it's a skin tint. And I'm going to show you which one I'm going to use. I'm going to use this one in here from the Nessa Myricks, the new release of the brand, the Yummy Skin. And I'm going to mix it with this product, also from the Nessa Myricks, the Illuminating Veil in the color Serenity. So we want a natural and glowy makeup. This is going to give us a natural makeup. This is going to give us a glowy makeup. So I'm going to mix the two and we are going to apply it on the skin. A little bit of the skin tint. And now let's pick the Serenity. Give a little pump of this one and mix the two. I've been seeing a lot of this trend on the internet. So of course I had to bring it to you. So you can see how you can recreate this beautiful makeup. I'm going to spread it with a bigger brush. I hope that you can see there that the skin is looking very glowy. This product from the Nessa Illuminating Veil. It has a little bit of glitter. The makeup looks very beautiful. It's an amazing product to have to give glow. I always apply a little bit more in the center of the skin because it's the place where we want a little bit more coverage. So I think that you can see there on the camera that it's looking so glowy, like it's really glowy. It's looking beautiful. Apply a little bit on the neck as well to give continuation and also helps the skin looks glowy as well. And I am just loving how it's looking. Now I'm going to apply my concealer. I'm going to use this one in here from Too Faced, Born This Way. So we can cover the under eyes a little bit and spread it with a sponge so it looks beautifully. Let's give some tabs on the skin as well with the sponge so the skin looks flawless. I always like to come in the end and give some tabs with the sponge. Now we are going to warm up our complexion with a cream contour. The one that I'm using is from Huda Beauty. It's a tour in the color light. Let's apply this one. Warm our complexions. This product is very good. Very easy to apply on the skin and gives an amazing look to the skin. Looks like you are bronzed. I think that you can see there on the camera. Do a little bit of contour to the nose as well. I'm just loving how my skin is looking. All bronze, all glowy. Of course that we are going to apply a little bit of powder next and it's going to look different but I am just loving it. Are you liking this video? If you are, don't forget to click on the thumbs up. We're not going to apply any kind of blush because this makeup is more bronze, so it's more for the browns. We don't have any kind of color that goes very far from that. Let's apply the powder next. The one that I'm going to be using, it's going to be also from the Nessa Myricks, the Evolution Powder in the color one. I'm going to apply it first underneath my eyes because this is a area where I like to apply very well the powder. I don't want my concealer to go anywhere. This powder is very, very good. The rest of the skin, I'm going to apply the powder, a bigger brush, because we want to give a little bit of powder to the skin, but not too much. A bigger brush is good for that. And as you can see, now the skin looks more 
normal it doesn't look as glowy as it looked uh, before I applied the powder but it still looks so beautiful so glowy so shiny even though we didn't apply any kind of blush I want to apply a little bit of highlighter and I'm going to use this palette in here from Dior it's in the color 001 universal and I'm going to pick a little bit here of the gold and apply it in here and also in here a little bit on the nose for the eyebrows we are going to use this one in here it's the brow micro filling pen by benefit it's a product that i really like to use in all of this makeup what we see is always the brows very perfectly very brushed i think that this product is going to be amazing first i'm just going to brush them a little bit and then apply the product <laughs> This product is very easy to apply and this color is very good for me, I really like. As you are seeing, it's giving beautiful brows. Now for the eyes, I'm going to use this palette in here from Natasha Denona. It's the Mini Nude palette and we are going to use this one in here that it's called Sienna. And with a blending brush, we are going to apply it all over the eye. it here to the tip of the brow let's do the other eye push it to the eyebrow and apply it all over the eye as well Now with a smaller brush with the same shadow we are going to apply it on the bottom part of the eye it's going to give some continuation the shadow that we already have on the upper part and now to complement the eye of course that we had to apply a little bit of one that i'm using it's from tarte it's in the color top yatch we are going to apply just a little bit the idea just to give a little color, not too much, but give a little bit of glow to go with the rest of the makeup. And it's looking amazing, so beautiful. And now, eyeliner. In this makeup, you can use eyeliner, but only a brown one. Don't use a black one. The idea with this makeup is using only brownish shades as you are seeing i didn't apply any kind of like big color or something that it was different from the brown i didn't apply blush and all of that we are going to use the color fix from the nessa myrix this is the number nude 8 and i'm going to apply a little bit here on my hand and do the eyeliner they are not looking exactly the same this one is a little bit more pointed than this one they are not twins they are only siblings but that's okay for the question of the day i want to ask you if this makeup are your kind of makeups or if you prefer more colored ones now it's the time for the mascara and the mascara is going to only be applied on our top lashes you're not going to apply the mascara on the lower lashes, only on the upper ones. Just a beautiful eye look. It's all combining so beautifully. So now let's do the lips. And continuing using the same vibes and all of that, 
We are going to use a lip liner that is brown. I'm going to use this one in here from Kylie. It's in the color Exposed. For lipsticks, I'm going to do a mix. I'm going to use these two from Maybelline. These are the 55 Driver and the 255 Chai Genius. So now let's apply the mix. I'm going to apply it with my spatula. That's it. Now to just finalize the makeup, to give it some duration, I'm going to be using my setting spray from Urban Decay The All Nighter. And the makeup is done. Tell me what you thought about the makeup. I think that it's really a perfect latte makeup. I'm looking so bronze, so glowy. I think that the makeup is looking so pretty, so beautiful. And we only used brownish, glowish, bronzed colors. If you like this video and you don't want to miss any of my other videos here on my YouTube channel, don't forget to go down there and click on the subscribe button and also on the ring bell and give it a thumbs up. I'm also going to leave down there my other social media if you want to follow me there as well. Now that we are on the end of the video, I just want to thank you so much for being here, for watching my video until the end. I really hope that you liked it and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye!